hello guys it's a girl if you kimura here you welcome back to my channel and if today is your first time clicking on my video i appreciate you as well but please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell for more of such informative educative and interesting content from here as a travel content creator i travel a lot and whilst i'm out of my comfort zone where i am i try different kind of foods yeah i love to try different things most especially when it comes to food so whilst in nigeria i had the opportunity to try some nigerian food of which i'm going to give my personal review about that and let's get right into the video let's go so to begin with the moment i entered nigeria even before getting to my lodging place this is the first food i tried with a friend i met on my way when entering nigeria i tried a baba for the start i uh, i tried his food first and for me i was all over eba i wanted to try eba so i went for eba <laughs> My first food in Nigeria, Eba and Oku. I for my first shock, I was shocked seeing them selling Eba on the street like that. Like you can go to a normal uh, street vendor, then buy Eba just like that that's not how it is in ghana for you to eat gary you have to do it yourself in the house but do you know what my first impression about nigeria was nice and the eba was nice charlie my first impression is the food yeah and it gave it out 100 over 100 the food was so nice with the okra soup stew or soup this is a goosey so i'm okay Oh, Nigeria is light out also. My phone is off. <laughs> we don't get equal quality. This I'm using a different phone. So my second time trying Gary. They say the first one I tried is Eba. But it, it seems the same thing. So, Gary and uh, Agusi. Yes, yeah, so that Agusi. It's very, very nice. Wow. I'm loving it. Mm. It's nice though. I also visited one restaurant in Lekki, Lagos called The Food Hub to try Nigerian jollof rice. How their foods are displayed looks so delicious and appetizing. ready so my jollof is here jollof rice and uh, chicken and also plantain yeah here they have different types of jollof rice i asked the woman i told the woman i'm buying jollof rice and she said which one so i have to point and do selection and this is our view from where we are eating so nice Anytime you visit Lagos Lekki, you can pass by this restaurant called Food Hub and try their food. They have a very nice environment. I love their settings and everything. So EJ ordered for uh, this food called My My. Yeah, he wanted me to try it and see how it goes. But my first try. Even in Ghana, foods that are made like this, I don't really, really enjoy them. Yeah, but I have to try. And he told me to mix it with the rice and go, but still, I wasn't getting the vibe and all that. But anyway, it was nice trying it. I loved it. Plus, the jollof and the plantain, everything was good. It's good to try something new. Yeah, it's not always what you are. Or your mouth or your tongue is 
familiar with that you have to try or you have to eat all the time sometimes you have to try something different i enjoyed the jollof rice so much nigerian jollof should i rate it should i should i rate it anyway anyway if you say i should rate it i did all the talking over there but because of the music it's gonna give me copyright so i have to do additional voiceover so with today i tried nigerian jollof i also tried ej's uh, plantain and the beans yeah i tried ej's plantain and the beans that one is normal everywhere some foods are normal everywhere in africa and most especially everywhere in the world jollof is a normal thing but it depends on how you're going to prepare it as i said earlier on anyway i loved everything and i love trying new things as well and i'm glad like glad glad that i tried nigerian jollof in nigeria not in ghana i'm going to try nigerian jollof in ghana but i'm glad i tried nigerian jollof and it's perfect it's good it's good Also tried different food at different restaurants on Lagos mainland. The restaurant is called the Yams Restaurant at Agor Palace, Agor Palace area. So this is it. And um, when I got here, I didn't know what to try because how they display the food makes it so appetizing and delicious from the sea. So what I decided was to try the yam, the yam and the egg stew was looking so appetizing and delicious so i went for the yam and the egg stew I got two slices of yam and the egg stew and the cassava fish so with here you have to buy everything separately when you buy the yam then you buy the stew then you buy the fish like they don't make everything in combination so you have to buy different different so i wanted to try the spaghetti so i asked uche to buy her buy the spaghetti in addition to his rice because i can't add spaghetti to uh, yam yeah so i wanted to taste it that's why i asked him to buy it he didn't request it for it i did actually not even tasted alone i gave it six over ten yes like i loved everything about it the yam the egg stew even the egg stew was killing me so now let's go the yam stew uh, the yam and the what do you call it the ebba and agusi was the food I loved so much. Although I loved all the food that I've tried, but the yams, the yam and the stew and the agusi was everything. Those are the foods I enjoyed so much. Yeah, I love them so much. With that, I'm going to give it 10 over 10 for the yam stew and the agusi and eba, especially for the agusi soup itself. Yeah, guys, so thank you so much for watching today. And, and this is my honest and personal review about most of the food I tried in Nigeria, Lagos. Thank you guys for watching. Kindly leave your comments in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, 
share and also if you haven't subscribed do so until meet again in my next video it's your girl if you came i love you and bye bye